NBC News is now taking Florida out of Vice President Gore's column and putting it back in the too close to call. It had to be the political equivalent of an earthquake. All of the networks were pretty trusting of this whole business of polling to have to flip it. You know, that's like cracking the tablets with the Ten Commandments. There was just kind of this moment of like, what's going on here? Do we not have a winner too close to call? But even then, too close to call, you're like, well, they're going to get this figured out in a few minutes. Jeb Bush, who is the governor of the state of Florida, we're told that just a few moments ago that Jeb Bush told his dad, former President Bush, that we won't know about Florida until at least midnight, between midnight and 1 a.m. Just as sort of devastating was the call of Florida for Gore originally, the retraction was like a shot of adrenaline. The hope was alive, and um, we all got energized again. Claire, we've got a uh, stunning piece of news for you. In Missouri, NBC News is projecting that Mel Carnahan, who was killed in a plane crash, has been elected over John Ashcroft, the Republican incumbent. That means that Gene Carnahan will go to the United States Senate. There will be a special election in two years. They were calling the race in Missouri for Mel Carnahan. And of course, there was not the usual cheers that you would hear. There were only tears. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.